Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I read this headline and said the Georgia woman pretended to be a Waffle House employee for two hours before robbing the place. I know it don't say that it happened in Atlanta, but I know damn well it did. I know either Atlanta or Augusta, one out of the two, but my money's on Atlanta. I promise you, because there's a whole lot of Waffle Houses in Atlanta, a whole lot of Waffle House employees in Atlanta, and a whole lot of them look like that. I'm dead daggone serious, man. Dead dag. I mean, like, I don't understand. Somebody could just walk like, no, that. that is typical. Waffle House, Atlanta behavior. Somebody just walk in with uniform on, don't nobody ask who it is, where they come from, did they clock in. She must have been working her ass off. She must have been helping the shift. She must have been cooking, mopping, you know what I'm saying? Taking, how the hell you pretend to do that? Like you can't just you got to understand that when you go work at the Waffle House, you got to figure out how to call the order. Pull two bacon, two hash browns, one chicken, hash brown, scattered, chunk, covered and smothered. All that other good stuff. How the hell you pretend that? Come on now, you washing dishes, you did all that. Two hours straight. You making waffles, burning up your damn hand on the waffle iron. Two hours. Then turn around and say, all right, that's it. Give me the money. She did all that for two hours, hell. I, I, even though she robbed the place, y'all owe her a check. I'm just saying. 